it's just exhilarating and exciting. They skate at over 30 miles per hour. We're going really fast out on the ice and it's completely man-powered. There's no additional equipment to make us go faster other than our skates. Every single one of our athletes is on a custom boot. They're made out of carbon fiber. Uh, they're extremely light. Chris Needham is Team USA's talent coordinator and skate technician. This is so, so critical, so absolutely critical. And this is something that we've really spent the last four years working on. It's Chris's job to make sure each athlete has the perfect skate. When we talk about a skate, there's really two parts to it. It doesn't matter if it's short track or long track. They have a boot and there's a blade. Stone on and just back and forth. The blade is thin, just 1.1 millimeters. Making sure it's sharp on race day is critical. One thing that we always say is you can have the most expensive, best fitting boots in the world and you can have the most well-tuned blades in the world, the most highest quality, everything. But if you don't have a good edge, it's all for naught because you'll, it's essentially having a race car with ball tires. In Chris's Olympic workshop, where he's busy sharpening and fine tuning, there are two types of skates, a long track skate and... This is a short track skate. Short track blades are fixed to the boot. In contrast to a short track skate... This long track not, skates or clap skates attach firmly to the boot only at the front, but the heel detaches from the blade. That allows the skater to lengthen their stride to get more power into the ice through the length of the stride. While the skates are different, they do have some similarities. The blade is actually offset on the boot. So if you look, the blade doesn't run right down the center of the boot, it's off to the side. And that's similar to like how, how a NASCAR is set up to only go in one direction. The athletes are getting stronger and faster, but according to Needham, the boots are a big reason why the speed skating world has seen over a dozen world records set in the past decade.